Mm, that climb never gets easier to get into your bedroom, sweetheart. Here, lucky I used to play football. Oh, asleep. That's fine. I'm happy to just toss my shirt off and join you. Mm. Sorry if I groan. The workout today was, uh, woof. Hey, sweetheart. Mommy's home. Scooch over for me, yeah? Oh, it's fine. I can just move you a little. Here. There we go. No, it's okay. You don't need to wake up, baby. I already know all about your day today. I know you skipped breakfast and lunch. I brought you some groceries and stocked your little mini fridge. You're doing well on your classes, though. That's what you always wanted, right? To work so hard you would never, ever have to go home. Ever again. Don't worry, baby. I handled that. I handled all those mean calls from your parents. I handle everything for you, don't I? Doesn't that make me good? Were you proud of me today, honey? I finally worked up the nerve to say hi to you after years. I know it didn't go very well. No. You're still nervous around me from high school, yeah? I know. I know. I was your bully. And that wasn't okay. It never was okay. I'm sorry, baby. I'm sorry I was mean. All I knew was mean before you. But I'm getting better now. Just for you. I'll be so good. I'll be so good that you'll love me back one of these days. I'll keep writing you letters, I'll keep paying for your tuition, and I will spend all the time I have at night with you. Even if I can sleep. <laughs> it's okay, it's okay. I don't want to sleep. I want to spend all of my time thinking about you. Helping you. Loving you. Can I tell you about my day, sweetheart? Thank you. It was okay. Math was a pain in the ass, as usual. Biology and chemistry are fun, though. Amazing how different parts that combine to make science as a whole can be either so, so entertaining or so, so boring. Still, it helps me treat your conditions. It helps me ease the pain you're in. You can rest. Rest with me. It feels so nice to be pressed against you like this. It's so nice to just be in a place that smells so much like you. And only you. But, uh... I wanted to talk to you about something. It's about the way you look at me. See... I never understood the way you looked at me, back then. Fear, certainly. And why wouldn't you look at the mean, scary girl that glared at you? But what else was it, sweetheart? I studied it for years when we crossed paths. And I think I finally understand what it is you have in those beautiful eyes when you try and sneak peeks at me. Hmm. Your heart is beating so quickly, sweetheart. Even when you're fast asleep. That's cute. It's lust, isn't it? Desire. That's what you look at me with, like a scared little mouse attracted to their cat. Am I right? Do you want me, baby? You know how badly I want you. Are you scared I'll hurt you? I am a lot bigger, I suppose. 
but I know you've been at least a little awake for some of our nights together. Why do you think I'm not scared of being caught? You know why. If the dean or someone else came in and saw me all entangled with you, if they demanded an answer, we both know what you would say. She's my girlfriend. I wanted her to be here. And I think you would ham and haw and say you were just saving me from expulsion, or something worse. But I also think you would get a real thrill out of seeing the look in his face. Mm. We would be quite the odd-looking couple, wouldn't we? I don't care. I adore the idea of how uncomfortable this raw passion would make people. I know you're at least a little awake. But I also know you're shy. Probably a little scared. So here's what we'll do. My front is flush with your back at present. I want you to roll over and bury your face in my chest. Okay? Palms down against it as well. When I see something you like or agree with, one pat. Two pats for no. If you understand that, then follow the first command. Oh, good baby. Now, do you feel safe? No. Do you like that you don't feel safe? Oh, this really makes me happy, sweetie. That you can open up. Even a little. You struggle so hard just to get out. To interact with the world without anxiety attack after anxiety attack. But you feel safer knowing I'm looking out for you, hmm? Do you appreciate me? Even though you're terrified of me. Do you love me? Baby, do you love me? <sighs> Good choice. It's okay. Even if you aren't sure now, I know that curiosity can turn into something more. And I certainly know that loss can turn into a lot more. I'm a patient woman. I can wait. I get more than enough comfort from just our little cuddle sessions. So take your time, sweetie. But I do have one more question before the sleep deprivation crushes my skull. Can I be your girlfriend? <laughs> Thank you. Right, murder really takes it out of me. So I'm gonna sleep now. Oh, don't worry about it. Just a joke, ex-police say. Night-night, hon-bon. <laughs>